Hey guys, welcome back to another video of the Gold Guys. It's been a while since our last video. Um, it's a crazy time of year for all of us. We came up here today to the river to kind of check it out. Um, obviously it's raging pretty good, too much for dredging. But we decided to come out and do a little high banking video for you guys. I just want to thank everyone for the 100 subscribers. That's pretty cool. Um, we just thought it'd be pretty fun to show people what we run into out here and, and what gold prospecting's like. Um, if you look, we got the high banker out here today. Got set up. The motor took off beautifully. Um, if you look, we put a shovel through here, kind of get us going as far as getting our level, getting the gravel out. Stay tuned and we'll get the digging for you. Thanks. going on guys so we started digging had a little bit of an oops i forgot to put a screw in that the only reason i screwed it was really just so we could do adjusting with it so it's not glued and permanent um we started digging we found some clay right off the bat so while i'm fixing that luke's gonna take a test of this clay and kind of see what's in it for you all right guys so uh the first shovel or two i hit clay um, we've done tests down here before. We know a lot of times the gold hangs up in the clay. Um, in this particular area, the gold and the clay run together, but then the clay is also in the bedrock here. Now that's not always the case, but it is here. So what I did, um, I picked up some pieces of clay that had made it through the high banker and didn't get broke up. Um, so we're going to pan those out and just see if there's any gold in them. I have a feeling there will be, uh, but we're going to do some tests to find out. Um, I'll go ahead and show you. That's what we got right there. We'll pan this out, see what happens. You see when you get it wet, this builds up into nothing. It's really hard to push it through the high banker and get all that stuff washed up and broke up. There are rocks in it. So you just got to sit there and work it. You see getting broke up now you basically just grind them rocks together with your hand and it'll break that clay up Just do a little better spot pan where the water's not rushing so hard. Let's try it right here. you can see it on camera yeah let me get you a little better angle
Well, I washed some of it away. But, right there, you can see a little bit right at the edge of the black sand. And see a couple pieces floating right on top of the water right there. Uh, so there's definitely gold in there. It's all real fine stuff, but that uh, proved my thought that there's probably gold in that clay layer. And there was. See if I can maybe do it again. There we go. A little bit more showing up right on that leading edge. So there you have it. Wash your clay really good. All right, guys. I got it fixed. Got it repaired. Fuck All right, that. so we're going. It's starting to rain on us here, but we're gonna get the shovel. We've done about oh, 10 shovel full so far, and there's a little bit of gold showing. So we'll get to work. Stay tuned. Been wanting to try this out it's a dream mat it's just a little sluice i got it to get cheap lots and lots of clay I don't know if you can see it real well, but it's whipping really good right there. It looks like it's packing up, but everything's moving, so I would say it's not. Alright guys, so we ran not much, 10, 15 shovelfuls maybe through that um, little tiny sluice with the dream mat and you can see a little piece floating right there and then we also got that i can't tell if it's focusing in the camera or not like i say that was 10 or 15 shovels worth um it's pretty fine there's another piece right there and another little piece right there um i was kind of wanting to check that dream mat out i was thinking about maybe getting it for the dredge uh we got a little surprise for you later um that got we uh, got some other things in the work also so yeah i think that dream mat works it caught the small stuff um it looked like it was packed up pretty good, but everything was moving. So I would assume that if it's moving, it's catching the gold. I don't know how much it lost. This isn't a loss test. This is just a does it work test. So there you have it. All right, guys, we're digging here. It's got a big old chunk of clay. That's what we have to do for all this clay in here. We just have to sit there and let it wash it away. Um, the hopper, the homemade hopper works pretty good on river gravel, but for that clay, it's being a real bear. But obviously it's worth the time to blast it away like that because we know from previous experience and videos that that's where a lot of the gold's sitting right now. So I just wanted to share that with you.
Alright guys, we decided to give our bracks a little bit of a break. <laughs> and we were just slowing down the motor to see what we had and we decided just to do a quick clean out for you. So, here we go. <laughs> We're a little rusty. First no. trip out of the year. Been We're still trying winter. to get things finished, figured out. It's <laughs> been a long winter. I almost filled my boot up with water. You want your big pan? Huh? <laughs> it was almost on camera there, ladies and gentlemen. I guess you could have just kicked the motor back on. <laughs> that would have been a smart idea. That's alright. That'll work just as good. Alright. I'm going to pan this out. We'll put it back together. And we'll show you what we got. So we're up here doing a clean out. When it gets down the end, we'll show you what's going on. It's already starting to show gold just a little bit, which means we got a bunch in there, no more than I got in my pan. Let's see if I can find a piece for you here, real quick. Right there, some there, there, a the piece right there. So it's in there. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. But usually it's a pretty good sign when you're just starting right off and you're already seeing a little bit of gold. So when we get this pan down, we'll show you the results. Alright guys, it's a real quick pan. Uh, this is what we got. There's still a bunch back here that just too much gold in there. I couldn't get couldn't get it cleaned out. I don't know, I might be able to kind of show you some of the other stuff. There's some more of the other stuff. So yeah, good clean out. All right, so that was the clean up there. We're gonna keep digging. That was about an hour and a half of digging, more or less. Maybe a little bit more. So not our best performance, but still pretty good. I can't complain. Since my health decided just to go take a walk, I was going to show you guys. When we're digging, we just dug straight down like we usually do. That's what we're looking for. 
I kept hitting really hard rocks down there and couldn't get any, hey, you know, any shovels up. We're looking for that. A few pieces of bedrock came up, covered in clay, obviously, but when you're digging down, and that's what we've been doing when we were dredging up here. So we hit stuff like that, and that's where we find a lot of our big gold. So, yeah, we keep digging. Or I'll keep digging, I don't know where he went. All right, guys, <clears throat> we're gonna call it a day. We were out here for how long, you think? Uh, like four hours. Four hours, five hours, who knows? It's we've like, been here a while. It's still like three or three. I'm pretty sure it's gotten colder since we got here. <laughs> Um, I think the high today was 39 and it's May 31st here in Colorado, so as you can tell I don't know what I don't know if you can tell that or not But it's a little cold out here <laughs> So we got everything packed up. Uh, we'll go home and get the gold cleaned up and show you guys what we got. Thanks for watching Could be the reason I'm freezing Ah, oh, damn, I almost got in my other boots. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Alright guys, we're back here at the house. We just got it all cleaned up right there. Show you the sun there. So we'll get it all weighed up. Show you what we got. Alright guys, we'll get the weight here for you. Point one three five. So, not the worst day. <laughs> I think the worst day we had was a Clear Creek video. If you guys watched that, <laughs> so not bad. We'll take it. All right, guys. Appreciate you guys watching the day. Um, like I said, one a point one three was what we got today. High bank, and we were digging for. Oh, I bet we dug for four hours, four and a half hours or so. So, like I said, not the greatest, but with the runoff and everything, that was about what we could do. Um, but we decided to show you kind of a little sneak peek. Dredging season's coming soon. Um, once the river calms down and we can get back in, we just kind of wanted to show you guys a little deal we got going on. So, this is the dredge that we had in the first video. And then if you come back with us here... We got another one. So we'll have two four inch dredges running this year. So the cleanup should be awesome. So. All right guys, so those are the two dredges. Um, stay tuned, cause that's coming fast. Once the river calms down and the runoff gets done, we'll get both of them in the river. And we'll see what kind of gold we can pull out. So thanks again for the 100 plus subscribers. We think that's pretty cool. Um, for what we're doing. Uh, stay tuned. Thanks.